Hey guys, welcome back to Buzz Geeks. In this video, I'm going to show you how to downgrade Windows 11 to Windows 10, right? So if you install Windows 11 on your PC and you're facing a problem or issues like bugs, going back to Windows 10 is the best option, right? If you want to learn that, please stick around. And if you're watching this video for the first time, please like it, subscribe, and let me know if it worked for you in the comment section. So guys, let's get started. Now to go back to Windows 10, all you need to do on your PC, go to your taskbar then click on start icon from this pop-up menu click on settings then under settings go to your left hand option then click on windows update down here right next under windows update click on advanced option then under advanced go to additional options down here and click on recovery option the next year you will see go back option right now you need to click on it and then go back to windows 10 process will start so all you need to do now is to follow all this prompt that i'm about to show you here as you can see things are getting ready the next here will be asked to give the reason to why you are going back to your previous windows uh, what i recommend is to give a genuine feedback uh, to microsoft for them to improve uh, on this windows 11 right so just be genuine with your feedback so if you have any that is listed here you need not click on this checkbox right here and that option will be selected and if your issue is not listed here just click down here and type in your issues yeah the issue you're facing right then once you're done click on next then on check for updates you can choose to check for updates but for me i'll just click on no thanks and here will be given a brief information on what will happen after you going back to your previous windows right so just click on next then next here again click on next on this window now right here you need not click on or go back to windows 10 button and the process of going back to your previous window will start right away so all you need to understand is that the process is going to take uh, a long time so you have to be patient and you won't be able even to use your pc so you have to be patient after this process back to your previous windows 10 right so guys that's how you can downgrade windows 11 to windows 10 so thank you so much for watching if you found it useful please don't forget to leave a like subscribe if you're new and i'll see you in the next video bye bye